Hi everybody, I wanted to share with you, these are the results in my garden so far after being able to go and apply some very specific things. I'm going to take you out to the garden and teach you right now what I did that actually saved my garden. Let's go. Okay, so one of the things I did is I went to Tractor Supply and I got some of the pine shavings and I took and put those shavings all around um, the base of some of my plants to kind of get them out of the grass. So that's one of the things I did. And the other thing I did is see this stuff called diatomaceous earth. I took and actually used this. It's kind of like a um, clay material. Okay, it's natural. It's something I wanted to use. It's actually good. You can use it for your animals. You can read all the uses here. It should be used for various livestock species, including, and it tells you all the different animals. All that's in there is diatomaceous earth. Okay, um, calcium bentonite. So I wanted to put this around my plants because I wanted something natural that would help and it actually has been working really well to keep away the cucumber beetles and also the squash beetles that were taking out my garden. So let's go take a look. Hi Eeyore, my donkey's not camera shy. Hey buddy, we're gonna go out to the garden. Are you gonna help me? So this is the effect of diatomaceous earth working in my garden. Are you saying hi puppies? Hello. <laughs> My cute puppies. Um, so you can tell the pumpkins are really taking off now. Yes, you're, you're happy. You see the garden's working too. It brought back these plants. I literally had almost lost the whole garden to those squash bugs. And now things are going really well. Um, some flowers are almost blooming. The corn is there. It had just about taken out all of my um, baby melon plants. And... Those are coming back and then our tomatoes i had to go ahead and stake these up because they're getting so heavy and full um this plant back here was really attacked by those squash beetles heavily um and cucumber bugs but i'm gonna go ahead and add some more diatomaceous earth the bugs are the the harmful insects like the squash beetles and the um, cucumber beetles are affected by that but our bees can still come in and pollinate everything so that's really exciting and I hope that helps you too. All right, excited to see what other things we get out of the garden. Some fresh basil I'm gonna use in my salad today. And here's another episode from my garden, working on this muck boots and stiletto series. I am the entrepreneur who loves to garden. We have farm animals and doing little farm school. While I'm also teaching my clients how to start their own businesses so they have more time and um, location freedom. So if that sounds like something fun for you and you'd like to be able to do some other things, your hobbies, spend time with your family, enjoy being able to serve your clients at the highest level while getting to explore your hobbies, reach out to me. I'd love to have a conversation with you. I hope this served you well. Have a great day.